Hey, nerds! Wow, I've had a really, really nice day. I just kind of sat back, relaxed all day, and didn't worry about editing, didn't, you know, really record, except for now, of course. And it was so nice. Oh my goodness, it was the nicest thing out there. Ah. I <laughs> oh man, I should do it more often. Anyways, less about that, more about what we're going to talk about. Because the instant I came back... And no, we're not talking about the weird Bride Tharja glitch. The instant I came back, I got a bunch of comments that were asking one question. And the really... <laughs> I'm not sure why this question sprung up a lot more on those videos, but I had to go and reply to a lot of them. And it was... Basically, the question is, are last year's bridal characters coming back? You know, are Lynn, Cordelia, Charlotte, and Sheeta, are they coming back as brides? Or are they going to be returning in a focus banner? I'm not sure if maybe people thought it was going to be Tempest Trials or something, but uh, let me just field this question as simple as I can, okay? So in March, we had a voting gauntlet that uh, featured last year's Easter units, and because of that, they brought last year's Easter units back. And a lot of you have been pointing this out to me when I said, oh, well, maybe they'll be doing, you know, bridal characters in a voting gauntlet, which we should be having one on the 1st of June. They'll probably bring them back, but some of you went and pointed out that technically the voting gauntlet does not have a focus banner in the uh, actual roadmap. So I'm just going to point this last little detail. You know, this is of course the ba well the roadmap featuring all the banners from that time around when the voting gauntlet went on, and as you can see, there is no voting gauntlet banner. But that does not mean that they won't be coming, and I'm almost entirely sure at this point that we can have a safe bet when it comes to that and just say that yes bridal characters are coming back most likely as the voting gauntlet and in fact that last voting gauntlet had the banner last well it actually started three days before the voting gauntlet and then it went on for at least a week or two so you're going to be able to get a lot of characters i mean we're going to be having these seasonal units we're going to be having the legendary banner that has a bunch of seasonal units, and then we're probably going to have the brides returning as well, adding into a plethora of, well, banners you can pull that will have a lot of seasonal characters for you. And I'm pretty sure this is what they're going to be doing with the voting gauntlet from here on out anyways, at least when it comes to, you know, uh, <laughs> gauntlet battles. We're probably going to be using that as an excuse to just bring back the old last year's units and that's actually something that's kind of exciting so always when you see something like this on the banner you know or on the roadmap and you're kind of wondering what's going on if there's any sort of special hero summoning event from here on out i'm almost certain that it will feature last year's characters so don't worry and stop stop trying to ask me this question okay it's coming with voting gauntlet i'm sure of it absolutely sure at this point honestly so you know patterns and all that fun stuff just gotta hand it to them. All right, nerds. I'm gonna go back to relaxing because I had a lot of fun. I hope you guys have a great day. It's just really weird for me right now. <laughs> gonna go relax. See you soon.